Uh, Psalm 73 is the first psalm of book three of Psalms um, and it's attributed to Asaph who was um, essentially one of David's worship leaders and we were just looking at it and one of the first things that, that comes to mind reading this psalm um, a few days ago uh, lockdown restrictions have been eased a little bit and we've noticed a lot of people out and about um, a lot of neighbours who are having lots of friends around and visiting people and there are a lot of people that are not socially distancing that are not following the rules and it's very difficult for those of us that have been following the rules to actually see this going on without feeling jealous without feeling frustrated and a bit annoyed that well why well is it wouldn't it be that easy for us to just go out there and do that um particularly as section four and five where it says they have no struggles their bodies are healthy and strong they are free from the burdens common to man they're not plagued by human ills and we felt like that really speaks into our situation and then we get down to verse 13 which says well surely in vain i've kept my heart pure in vain i've washed my hands of innocence but then it goes back to so so towards the end we've got verse 26 and it kind of comes back to us personally, uh, saying, My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart. I was thinking, you might have been physically ill, you might just be feeling downcast, but actually it's remembering God is, is our strength. And it goes on to say, you know, God will judge those that need judging. He will punish those if needed. Um, but importantly, we've got verse 28. It suddenly says, but as for me, and we just thought that was quite interesting. It's actually not looking at what everybody else is doing and thinking, as for me, what what am I doing? It says, as for me, it's good to be near God. It carries on with, um, right at the end, but as for me, it's good to be near God. I have made the sovereign Lord my refuge and I will tell of all your deeds. Those are the three things that we need to be focusing on. We don't need to be looking at what everyone else is doing. Um, even at this really difficult time, it's really easy to look at what el everything else that is going on. But right here in Psalm 73, there are three things. And these are our challenge to you today. What are you doing? Are you near God? Are you making him your refuge? And are you telling of his deeds? Because he will do the rest.